week is a time for packed stomachs and packed bars, but this year for people who own those businesses, their minds have also been filled with new things to worry about. Yeah, five people were killed, 20 others hurt in a bar shooting last weekend out in Colorado. And with that as a backdrop, we head into Thanksgiving Eve tomorrow, the busiest bar night of the year. And WLWT News 5's Danielle Dindak is live to see how bar owners are taking safety into consideration this holiday season. Danielle. Mike Tree, it is the quiet before the storm down here at the banks. After all, like you both mentioned, tomorrow is Thanksgiving Eve, the busiest bar night of the year. And the places that I went to today, they all stress the biggest thing for them is that you go out tomorrow, you have fun, but that you get home safe. It's officially that time of year. Shaking things up before the turkey comes out. People will flock to the bars on Thanksgiving Eve. Commonly known as the busiest bar night of the year. Ali Everly is the general manager of Somerset Bar in OTR. It's our job to make you have a good time and it's our job to make you get home safe as well. It's especially true just days after a mass shooting at an LGBTQ nightclub in Colorado Springs that left five people dead and many others injured. Unfortunately, with what we saw this past weekend, um, Bad things can happen anywhere, um, but we take extra safety measures. Those safety measures include metal detectors and wanding people, not allowing any weapons and lots of security. At the end of the day, keeping our guests and staff safe is our number one priority. That priority also shared by the Monkey Bar in Mainville. It's a community-driven, family-friendly spot, expecting a big crowd Wednesday night. We really care about people. We care about our employees. They will have Ubers ready for those unable to drive and stepping up safety with undercover officers. Just to protect you know, our community and stuff and just kind of oversee things, make sure everything's going smooth here. So I mean, just that presence of having our locals in, in our facility is big here. Somerset Bar also telling me that their entire staff has underwent active shooter training. Reporting live from the banks, Daniel Didek, WLWT News 5.